Today I've got an extra special healthy treat for you for when the sweet tooth hits chocolate covered banana bites. It's the perfect dessert or midnight snack and this is how you make it. We will need one fairly ripe banana with a couple brown spots but still firm so it holds its shape. Peel the banana and then cut it into bite-sized pieces. The bigger the pieces, the more banana and less chocolate you'll have per bite, or the smaller the pieces, the more chocolate you'll have per bite. Now place those banana pieces onto a parchment paper lined baking sheet. And now comes a very special ingredient, natural nut butter. My favorite, favorite, favorite is hazelnut butter, but any natural nut butter will work. Now put that nut butter on every single banana piece and place the banana pieces into the freezer for just about 10 minutes. And during those 10 minutes, we're going to melt some 80% dark chocolate. You can do this in the microwave or over a water bath. All you want is to have very smooth and glossy chocolate. At this point, we're going to take the banana pieces out of the freezer and we're going to use two forks to put the banana into the melted chocolate and cover it with the melted chocolate and then take it out, let it drip a little bit and place it back on the parchment paper lined baking sheet and then sprinkle with flaky sea salt. Then place it back in the freezer for just about five minutes and it's time to eat. Chocolate covered bananas are so, so, so yummy. And because they were in the freezer for a little bit, they're almost like little ice cream bites. I love serving them as dessert for my children. They last in the freezer for probably a week or longer. I just can't tell you because I couldn't keep them in the freezer for longer than a week. I really defended one little piece and after a week it was still perfect, but they might last a little longer. Tell me if you were able to keep them in the freezer longer and how they held up. I usually keep them in an airtight container in the freezer and that way we can just grab a little dessert every day. I hope you're gonna give this recipe a try. If you do, please don't forget to snap a picture and show me. I love seeing when you make any of my recipes and I'll see you with my next video. Bye.